1939. Finland is fighting desperately against the Soviet Red Army and is waiting for help from her Western allies. Despite requests from their own people, neither France or England are willing or able to take any decisive actions against the Soviet Union. Finally, after 105 days of hard fighting, the Finnish army is near collapse and Finnish politicians are forced to agree to the Soviets' hard terms of peace. Finland celebrates that day by flying flags at half-staff. A hard and fierce war is followed by a difficult peace, with food storages depleted, mass civilian evacuations, with tens of thousands of men killed or permanently wounded, the armed forces speed up, resources depleted and trade routes closed, Finland is faced with serious problems. Sweden cannot provide sufficient help. And of the two major powers around, only Germany is willing to trade with Finland. In the beginning of 1941, Germany takes Finland into its circles and informs the civilian and military rulers of Finland of their plans against the Soviet Union. Due to past agreements on troop and material transports to Norway, there are already some German troops in Finland, and Hitler wants to open another front against the Soviet Union through Finnish territory. It is made clear that this will happen with or without Finnish consent. Finland sees this as a chance for retribution against the Soviets, and agrees to join in on the fight. And so, in June of 1941, the continuation war begins.